Um, there was something, something extraordinary happened uh, 500 years ago when the first novels were written in Europe. Uh, the novel as a genre is a European creation. Um, when those first um, uh, uh, those first characters appeared in novels by Miguel de Cervantes, um, by an anonymous writer who wrote La Sarida de Tormes, a, a small uh, Spanish novel, something extraordinary happened in Europe. People started to look at other people from the inside. For the first time, I think, um, a degree of empathy towards the other began being experienced by European citizens. And this is extraordinary. The impact on this, of this on our societies is extraordinary. Milan Kundera writes in a beautiful essay called Testaments Betrayed, um, he writes that Europe is used to think about itself uh, as the inventors of human rights. But in order for human rights to be invented, first we had to recognize each other as individuals, to recognize our values as individuals and the values of others as individuals. And this, Kundera said, is the consequence of European arts in general, but in particular, the art of the novel that teaches us to be curious about each other, to try to look inside each other and to try to understand lives not our own. This immense shift in perspective is due to the art of the novel, a particularly European art. And I'm very proud um, to be here uh, uh, defending this idea um, that uh, the, this thing I do for a living, writing novels, is one of the most complex attempts we can make as human beings um, uh, uh, to be tolerant, to understand each other, and to achieve a degree of empathy that we would not be able to achieve outside this kind of moral imagination. Thank you. It's nice to hear from a non-European that how we are as European, what our, what our histories and the novels, and thank yeah, you. I, I think you are doing all right.